Hi, my name is Dana. I'm a graduate student at the University of Alaska in Fairbanks, and I'm working with Dr. Heidi Pearson on this project studying how whales impact carbon and nutrient cycling in Southeast Alaska, primarily through their poop. And I'm actually here in Southeast Alaska right now in Warm Springs Bay at the Alaska Whale Foundation Field Station, where I'm based for the summer to collect data for this research. Let's talk about poop. I collect humpback whale fecal samples opportunistically, which means whenever we find them, using this plankton net, and I scoop this through the water and it helps to collect all of the material in one place. This is a CTD, which was purchased with support from WDC, and it essentially measures temperature, salinity, and chlorophyll over the depth throughout the water column. From that, we can tell the structure of the water column itself and the concentration of phytoplankton over depth. I deploy the CTD by hand over the side of our Zodiac or our other boat at 115 different stations throughout Southeast Alaska. And we do that each month so that we can detect seasonal tech change and spatial change. I also collect water samples at three different depths throughout the survey area at select stations and adds up to about 30 deployments of the vertical water sampler and 90 samples per month. The vertical water sampler allows me to collect water from depths that are unreachable otherwise, and it closes at depth and then allows me to pull up water from one meter, 10 meters, and 30 meters. I'm very grateful for WDC for their support of this research, and I'm excited to show you the kinds of data that we collect.